We were hoping to do a demo cook out here on the patio, but if you look outside, you'll see it's sprinkling outside right now. So we are in our breezeway, and the camera girl is gonna sacrifice herself minus the camera by standing at the doorway because we don't want to get the camera wet. But uh, I want to showcase uh, two things today. One, I have this uh, P30. It's a P30. It's a single burner from Camp Chef. I've had this for about a month now. And we use this a couple of times. I really enjoy using this here. And uh, this is a, could be a very useful thing to have in a, like an emergency or something. But also we enjoy, I think we're going to enjoy having this because I love to cook fried chicken. And I can do this outside without stinking up the kitchen. And uh, the second thing I want to showcase is this skillet, this beautiful pan here. Uh, I received this as a gift from my uh, brother. Now my brother and my sister-in-law, now they are real cooks. Let me tell you right now, they know how to really cook. And for some reason or other, they sent me this pan. They sent this not just to me, they sent this to Camera Girl and me. It's a uh, cast iron. Uh, skillet here. It's a very nice one. How much does it weigh? I don't know. It weighs a lot. Okay, I told my brother that I would, uh, when I do a cook on this, I will film it and uh, let him see our cook. I'm gonna cook a ribeye here. You see, I got a ribeye. And I've only seasoned this with It's Incredible. I'm just gonna do this real simple here. We like It's Incredible. I'm going to, uh, make some onions and this has uh, some uh, poblano peppers in here and I'm gonna mix that with some little Canucket sausage here okay then I gotta turn this thing on now I order a igniter for this whoa mama. whoa <laughs> okay let's do it slow here notice this flame this is the 30,000 BTU cooker here it's great isn't it look at this Beautiful. So I'm gonna get this down lower, and uh, I'm gonna start off with the uh, vegetable and canucket first, and uh, I'm gonna cook them first, maybe uh, three quarters of the way done, and then I will put them back in the this pan here, and then I will do the steak, and I'll let the steak rest, and then I will finish off the vegetables here. But in any case, so I'm going to start off with the uh, with the uh, pan to see what the temperature is. See, this thing is up to like uh, 135 degrees. Now I had to turn this down low. I'm trying to just get this slow. I had this on low right now. Let me get this on medium here. Actually, it's not on medium, but just slightly above low. Listen, I'll get back with you uh, in a few minutes here once we get to cooking, okay? Gilbert, if you're watching, that's my brother. Uh, I just uh, put a little avocado oil in here and I dumped the Canucket sausage in. Just browning this up a little bit here. This is uh, not cooked sausage, it's very tasty. I don't know if you can get this in uh, where you are living right now. But I'm going to, uh, oh boy, it's smelling good, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna put the onions in here. Let this thing just melt down. Oh yeah. Oh, look how nice this pan is here. See? Nice size pan, isn't it? Camera crew, do you like this pan? Oh yeah, I like this pan. Oh yeah, look, it's smelling good. Yeah, it smells very good. I love fried onions. Nothing like fried onions. I'm gonna season it. I just have it out here right now. Just some, uh, it's incredible. And so it's it very good. We've uh, liked this uh, It's Incredible for a long time. This looks like I chopped this uh, very nicely here. But that's okay. Oh, wow. You think you go eat this? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this will take a few minutes and we'll get back with you. All right, as you can see in here, the onion is uh, coming out wonderful. The pepper is uh, 
getting, uh, you know, stir fry, whatever you call that term, the Kanaka sausage, that I'm sure is done. It's been maybe five, seven minutes, eight minutes, I don't know. But I want to get the onion. See how I want to get the onion? I want to get the onion like translucent and brown here like that. You see? You see? Mm -hmm. And then it released the sugar to get very sweet. I used to love to eat onions with our liver and onions growing up. My brother can probably tell you that. I like the onions more than I like the liver. And I would eat the liver so I can get the onion. We're gonna put the steak on and I'm gonna clean this pan up a little bit and we'll get back. All right, this pan is pretty hot. I'm gonna put the steak on. And this is our maiden voyage. Thank you so much, Gilbert and Pam. Here it goes. Okay, this will take a few minutes here. We'll let it uh, cook. Again, it just seasoned with nothing but just uh, salt and probably some, uh, it's incredible. Here's the steak. Uh, camera girl's inside, just a minute. I'm gonna, I'm filming, I'm gonna turn the steak over. Let's see what she looks like. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at that, look at that beauty. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh boy. Ooh, baby. Ooh. All right, the, uh, you can see the steak looks really beautiful. Uh, when the camera's off, you can see I uh, browned the edge here by holding it so. And you can hear that sizzle. Boy, that's uh, that's flavor there. Let me tell you, this is wonderful. This is really, really wonderful. Oh my goodness gracious. This steak, I don't know, uh, it hasn't been very long, but this is not necessarily a very thick piece of steak here right now. I, I think my uh, sister-in-law was telling me that you're supposed to put this in the oven, but I, I don't think they do that. I don't think we're going to do that either. All right, you can see. You can just look at the sizzle here. Look at that sizzle here. Wow, that's amazing. All right. Be careful the oil, honey. That's why I put the apron on here. Oh, my goodness. This thing is it's just amazing. Look at this. Whoa. Okay. Well, I tell you what. We're going to, I just want to do this cook to show my, our appreciation to my uh, brother and sister-in-law, how much we appreciate their thoughtfulness here. Uh, Camera Girl and I know we will be using this, and uh, I just want to record this, and uh, thank you very much, Gil and Pam, and uh, we're going to get ready to eat. I'm going to, we're going to uh, turn the camera off in a few minutes here. I'm gonna, all I'm going to do is put the vegetables back in here, finish them up a little bit, crisp them up. And uh, but meanwhile, God bless you, God bless America, God save the Republic.